both of these cars, but I can only afford one. Hmm, I don't know which one I should get. Is there anyone else around here that could help me possibly? Hello, how may I help you? And by the way, welcome to Ryan Honda. As you can see, we have these two cars. Uh, yeah, I was wondering, how much does this uh, Mustang cost? Ooh, I'm so glad you asked because that, that over there is a 2007 Mustang. And by the way, it will be... $4,000. $4,000? Hmm, not bad. What about the other car right next to you? This one right next to me is our Audi RS5 Coupe. It is a 2018. This one will cost, hmm, right around 30000 to 35000 Oh, um, I guess I'll just get this Mustang. All right, let me just go get someone else that can do that for you. Hey, you over there, can you go get me someone? Seriously, that's how you're going to treat me? Wow, I am so surprised you can work here. Ugh. Oh boy, he's a loud one. Ugh, I hate those type of people that are so loud. Okay, let's see. What am I going to get? Um, I guess I can try and get this blue car or this white one. Hmm, not sure. I'll have to see if anyone is working. Hello, how may I help you? Hi, how are you? Anyways, I wanted to buy one of these two cars. How much are they? Um, these are under at least $2,000, but you seem like you could spend a lot more than that. Um, the truth is I'm kind of broke right now and I only have like $3,000 on me. So do you have any other cars besides these ones for that cost? Yes, I do. Follow me. Are these two something you thought about? Uh, not exactly. Do you have any other cars besides these two? Yes, I do. Ugh, more walking. I can't take any more. How about I give you this red car right here? We'll take it down to the cost you can pay it for, but the monthly payment will be more than what you can afford. Wait a minute, I see what you're trying to do. You are trying to trick me into buying a car I can't even afford. Do you have a proof of that at all? Oh my gosh, I don't need proof for that. There's security, security cameras around here, so I could just sue you for doing that to me. Ugh, I'm just gonna find someone else. Dang, I'm so surprised he's so smart. <sighs> mm-hmm, this is my ride. I have to get this car so badly. Like, a convertible would be cool with me, Riley, and Trevin in it. Maybe even some other friends. Man, I would love to buy this car, but it doesn't have a cost on it. Huh, I wonder if anyone else could help me. Hey, excuse me, ma'am. Do you know how much this car would cost? Uh, I... I don't know. Uh, I'm sorry, what was that again? I said, I don't know. You didn't quite catch that again. I don't know. This is ridiculous. Can you go get someone else? Because you're talking, like, too low. Fine. Finally, someone that's not shy or, like, really bad at talking. What do you want? Because I heard from what she told me that you were being a bit rude to her. Uh, no, I actually wasn't. I just wanted to know the price on this car. Well, this here costs $7,000 to $8,000. And by the way, she's very shy, so you should be nice to shy people for your information. Okay, 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 okay. Sure, I was being a little bit harsh, but it's not that bad. Seriously? Not that bad? Who does this guy think he is?
Dude, I'm telling you the truth. I bet this convertible is a lot nicer than that Mustang you think is so cool. Oh, please, Omar. This Mustang is better than that convertible. I bet it's like 200 miles per hour. Please, that Mustang? Man, you're like so cheap on that. Oh my goodness. These guys are like arguing nonstop. Ugh, I really have to use the restroom, but I don't want to pass by them because the restroom's right next to them. Ugh, I wonder if I should just wait a little longer or something. Listen, buddy, I think I'm going to get this convertible and you can't stop me. Not unless I buy it first or I'll just take your Mustang instead and you could take the convertible and then you can share it with Terrence or whatever. You know what? Fine, that's a deal. I'm gonna get this Mustang, how about that? And then you get the convertible and we can share it once in a while. <sighs> I really just wanna avoid this conversation, but I really have to go. Uh, what to do, what to... <gasps> what if I just sneak past them? All right, that's settled then. We are going to find someone to let us pay for these two cars, and that's that. Fine, deal. That was a close one. Man, they're like finally making a deal. That's a good thing, because they're so annoying when they're arguing. Okay, so it's my first time at Ryan Honda. Hmm, I think I'll go look at the cars or something. Um, well, I like all the c cars here. Um, I'd probably pick the blue one or the black one. I don't know which one I'd pick yet. It's so hard to pick one. Hello, welcome to Ryan Honda. My name is Justin. How may I help you? Um, hi, this is actually my first time at Ryan Honda and I was just wondering what kind of cars you guys have. Oh, that's easy. We just have a lot of Honda cars. We even have some different brand cars here because apparently some of the other dealerships have to like remake stuff so they sent all their cars here so it's been a big mess lately oh okay nice um what cars would you recommend for a new person that comes here um personally me i would recommend probably the blue or the purple car for you because they are a pretty good decent deal i'll keep looking thank you anyway you're welcome just let me know if you have any questions hmm so nice of him greeting me wow i never even knew people did that at this type of job anyways let's look at the cars because these look quite nice Okay, dude, what do you think? I'm thinking about getting the black car with the white stripes on it. Yeah, that's a pretty cool one. I don't know if I really want to get this white one, but I mean, it looks okay, I guess. Oh yeah, true, true, true that. Hmm, I don't know what you can get yet. I don't know either. I need like some help or something. I heard someone needed some help. Hi, yes, I need some help on picking a car because my friend here just got wants to get this black car, but I really don't like this white car. Oh, okay, that's perfectly fine. We have a ton of more cars here as well. I can show you one of the nicest cars that you might get. Uh, sure, I guess we'll go with that first. All right, follow me, please. Okay, so I would recommend probably the yellow car mostly for you, or you could pick this old white car. Um, I guess I'll get the yellow car because that one looks so cool. All right, I'll just go get the paperwork. Sweet ride, man. That's gonna be a sweet ride for you and your girlfriend for sure. I know Cecilia will be so happy. What about your girlfriend Eva? Won't she be kind of happy with your car? Uh. Yeah, possibly. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'll get a different car, actually. Uh, well, good luck with that. By the way, if that lady 
That lady, she hasn't came back for a while, actually. Yeah, maybe maybe it's really busy here, but she seems really sweet and nice and very helpful. Hmm, I'm trying to think of what I want to get because my wife did want me to get a new car. Hmm, I kind of want to go with this blue one that's old school or this red one that could be, like, a nicer car, but, like... What's wrong with my truck? I own a truck. I'm not a car person. <sighs> Whatever. I'll just find myself a car, I guess. Hello, sir. How may I help you? Hello. I'm having a little bit of trouble on what kind of car I want to get right now. Oh, I see. Well, depending on what car you want to get, I'd probably recommend the blue one for you just because you seem like an old school type person. You see, ma'am, I'm, I was born in the 70s, so yeah, that's... That's why. Oh, okay. I see what you're saying. Hmm. How about we look for a different car for you that's definitely an oldie? Um, sure. We can keep looking around. This car might be the right one for you because I heard from what my parents told me, this car was made in the 1960s, so I think it's totally old school for you, and I'd recommend it for you. Oh my gosh, I remember on TV once they had it on auction for like thousands or millions of dollars. Like, it is really old, and a lot of people like some of the old cars. Yeah, that's what I've heard as well, but like, I'm not really into the old school type cars, but like, they're neat anyway, but... It's your choice on whether you want to buy it or not. All right, well, I'll go talk to my wife about it. Mm, this is so hard. Ugh, I can't decide. Jim? Jim, is that really you? It's been like so long since we've seen each other. Oh, hey, Scott. Hey, oh, hey, sorry about that. It's just been a long, it has been a long time since Michelle and I kind of um been going on trips and stuff. So yeah, she wants me to get a new car. Ah, I can see that. Oh my gosh. This car, this car was like a fortune back when I was like a child, since I was born in the 52 or 54. Yeah, I remember this car so much. Yeah, the lady that helped me, she was really sweet and nice, so I'm hoping we can run into her again and then I can just tell her that I'm gonna buy this. You totally should. Don't put it up for auction because those cost so much. Um, I don't know if I want to buy this car or not, because, like, I don't know. It's kind of confusing. I wonder if anyone can help me. You said you wanted help? Uh, yes. Do you guys have any other cars like this or that are a little bit better than this type of car? Uh, I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I just don't know. Don't care. What? That doesn't ma does not make sense. How do you not know or don't care about it? Eh, because I just don't at all. Anyways, have a nice day. Wow, I am so surprised she could walk off like that. I gotta go speak to the manager. Okay, so I'm pretty new working here, but it seems very peaceful and very relaxing. Huh, now I just gotta figure out how I can help customers out. Excuse me, I really need to find this perfect car for perfect somebody and no one can help me out so far, so I was wondering if you can help. Oh, um, hi, hi. I, uh, would love to actually help, but, uh, I'm new to the job, so I'll try my best. You gotta be kidding me. You're new here? Uh, how can that be so? Because, like, I need someone that's experienced, someone that can actually help me out with this. I'm sorry, ma'am. I'll, uh, go get someone else that can help. You're a waste of my time. I'm just gonna go find someone else. Uh, I did not expect that at all. Like, she was a little bit rude to me because I'm new. <sighs> well, I'm gonna have a lot to learn until the year goes by. Um, I think I've made a decision. I'm going to buy this car because like, it might be very nice. Hey, excuse me. Yeah, what do you want? I wanted to know, do you have any paperwork or anything that I need to fill out so I can get this car? Not with me, no. And by the way, this car is not for sale, even though it says it is, but it isn't. 
Uh, but it actually says a price and it actually says that you could still buy it. Do I look like I'm someone that cares? No, I don't care. So just ask someone else. Fine. I'll go ask someone else because you are being completely rude for no reason. Go for it. I hate this job anyway. Wow. She was so rude. Oh my gosh. She's not so helpful at all. Hmm. I'll go find someone else then.